2018 Nissan Kicks First Drive Review. Colin Chapman's famous catchphrase, simplify, then add lightness, referred to his philosophy of making his Lotus road and race cars faster by removing weight rather than adding power. I can't help but think Nissan drew inspiration from Chapman's ideals when the company distilled the 2018 kicks into a simple, spacious, no-frills crossover that undercuts and outperforms its competitors in key ways. And the competition is fierce, the Hyundai Kona, Jeep Renegade, Honda HR-V, Toyota CHR, Kia Soul, and Ford Eco Sport are all about the same size. Compared with those, the Kicks is right in the middle in terms of length, 169.1 inches, features a slightly longer wheelbase, 103.1 inches compared with its competition's 102.3 average, with a width, 69.3 inches, that's slightly narrower than those rivals, and a height, 62.4 inches, that's the second shortest. Compared to the Juke it replaces, the Kicks is longer thinner, and just about the same in terms of height. But where Chapman's adage applies is the kick's power-to-weight ratio. Despite its raw horsepower figures trailing the rest of the cuve litter, the kick's 1.6-liter 16-valve four-cylinder engine is rated at just 125 horsepower and 115 pounds to foot of torque, highway merging isn't much of a problem. The Kicks weighs just 2,639 pounds, which is between 300 and 700 pounds lighter than the outgoing Juke depending on trim level. This gives it a power-to-weight ratio equivalent to its more powerful, yet heavier, adversaries. Each of the Kicks horsepower pulls just 21 pounds, compared to, for example, the Soul's 24 pounds its relatively light structure means that it can also return a frugal, and best in class, 31 miles per gallon in the city, 36 miles per gallon on the highway, and a combined 33 miles per gallon. Compare this to CHR, 29 combined, Kona, 30 combined, Soul, 27 combined, HRV, 31 combined, Renegade, 26 combined, and Ego Sport, 28 combined. Driven enthusiastically through some choice canyon roads, I struggled to get less than 31 miles per gallon average, which is an impressive feat. The little engine is harnessed to Nissan's Tronic Continuously Variable Transmission CVT, and though smooth in its power delivery, it drones annoyingly when putting your foot down while getting onto the highway. While it's nice to know that the Kicks is light enough to make do with its comparatively meager horsepower, buyers who are actually going to haul people and stuff in the Kicks will also be curious about its interior dimensions. There's good news, despite its below average weight, the interior measurements are all above average, including headroom, 40.738.5 inches front and rear, legroom, 43.733.2 inches front and rear, and the largest cargo space of all, 25.3 cubic feet. Underneath the Kicks new body is a platform shared with Nissan's compact Versa sedan. At the front are independent struts and shocks, while at the back is a twist beam rear suspension with twin tube shocks. On the road, it's not as fun to toss around as the nimble Mazda CX-3, which is the best handling vehicle in the segment. The Kicks rides like a slightly lifted Versa, compliant enough on a straight road, but there's significant body roll in a turn, and not much feedback is provided to the driver. The Kicks makes do with rear drums. Despite the archaic setup, it has plenty of stopping power, with great initial bite and a reassuring pedal feel. Furthermore, the Kicks comes standard with automatic emergency braking, the only vehicle to do so in its segment. Steering is electrically controlled, and it provides adequate sensation through the wheel. As you would expect, as speeds increase, the resistance from the wheel increases. At highway speeds, the steering feel is heavier than it needs to be. What you can't get on the Kicks, but what the HRV, Kona, and Renegade offer, is all-wheel drive. Front-wheel drive is enough for most drivers, if they fit adequate tires for the season and conditions. 
the kicks is sure-footed enough that those drivers won't miss the extra driven wheels. The lighter weight philosophy, a loose but successful interpretation of Chapman's mantra, also means the 2018 kicks does more with less. Considering the entire package, it's our new favorite bargain in the compact crossover segment. Thank you.